guys, so today I thought I would film kind of a different video. Now, uh, before we proceed with this video, I would like to point out that yes, I do look disgusting today, and I do look disgusting in most videos. Let's just flow with it and move on with our lives. Anyways, today I am filming a reacting to my old diaries. <laughs> video. If you didn't already know, I am quite the writer. I have always had like a passion for writing and stories and stuff like that. That means that over the years, I have acquired many, many, many journals. These are three of a lot in my bookshelf. Yes, I am aware that this is nothing fashion, beauty, or I don't know, skincare related, whatever I do on this channel. I kind of just wanted to, you know, make a fun little video. This one has flowers on the cover and you can see how old it is because my dog has made bite marks in it. Oh my gosh, this was my bookmark. Does anyone remember using these in school? What are they called? Like templates? I took these from my school like unknowingly and I put them in my backpack and I never gave them back and apparently I stuck them in my journals. Be gone, template. Right on the first page you can see I ripped out some pages. I used to do that all the time because I thought that my handwriting, you know, like wasn't neat enough. When I grow up, I would like to be a fashion designer. Felt D-E-Z-I-G-H-N-E-R. Okay. Oh yes, to be a fashion designer would be just the best thing in the world. I mean, designing. D-E-Z-I-G-H-N-I-N-G. Caitlin, you make yourself cry. I can't believe I spelt the word fabulous right and I spelt the word design wrong. Can't you just see it? I could actually be designing some of the most famous clothes in the world. Could actually be so good that we can make it on TV for people to see forever and ever and ever. <laughs> Stores people. P-O-O-P-L-E. I buy most of my clothes from Justice. Oh my gosh, does anyone remember Justice? But that is not from my designs. My designs are more like boom, unexpected. My designs are more like boom, unexpected, everybody. My designs are really silly, or maybe, spelled M-A-B-E. Foolish. Yeah, foolish. I just want to make my designs different. Actually, I think that mine are better. Today, Kyla and Cam came over for a sleepover. Kyla and Cam are my younger cousins, by the way. I was having fun and at the same time being kind of annoyed because all they wanted to do is play baby. B-A-B-B-I-E. Oh. I'm sorry, there's a snowplow outside my house. <sighs> gosh, Caitlin. Yay, it's almost Thanksgiving. Today when Alana's brother Alex fell down on his scooter, me and Alana both rushed over and helped him. We wanted him to leave us alone, so I had this whole speech that I had to say to Alex just to leave us alone. Alana, she used to be my neighbor before she moved and she had a little brother named Alex. Apparently I thought he was annoying. But let me just tell you, diary, spelt D-A-I-R-Y. Let me just tell you, dairy. It wasn't easy because I did most of the talking. Besides, I'm older than Alana, so I have more responsibility. R-E-S-P-O O N S I V I L E T Y to be more moot mature. M O T O R E. She is polite and I'm polite, but she's very polite over my house. It makes me look bad in front of my mom and dad. Do any of your friends do that? They're so polite around your mom and dad and they make you look like so like a bad child. I do that all the time when I'm over at my friend's house, but when my friends are here, I'm like, honey, nah, -uh. you act with my parents the way you act with me. Hello diary, sorry I haven't been in touch with you for a while. There has been a lot of things on my mind. My friend abandoned me, now I feel awful. Also I hit my lip. I can't quite remember what happened, but it was my dog. I have a puffy lip. Well that's it for today. Mine truly, Caitlin Buckley. Ooh, I, I wrote this one on Valentine's Day. I think this was one of the days where it was like in elementary school when you would have those little like paper bag things that everyone would bring in and then you'd have like a class list and then you would have to give every single person in your class a Valentine. You thought you were like super gangster and went against the rules so you wrote like special notes to your friends. Just wrote your name for everybody else's. I'm just a rebel, aren't I? Dear Diary, today was an interesting day. This kid is being a big meanie to me. Whenever I tell or at least try to tell on him, he gives me the tell and I'm going to be really mad look. Just so you know, this kid probably actually didn't do anything wrong. I was just probably overreacting because I did that a lot when I was younger. Hogwarts. I got this at Harry Potter World. You know you're a geek when you use really long words. Your fashion sense is pretty unique. Oh my gosh, I know where this is from. Does anyone remember that Disney movie called Geek Charming? The promo for it, like the commercial, it says like, you know you're a geek when you use really long words. And then I thought I could copy it down to make myself sound cool. In this book, there's this one guy that's mentioned like a lot. I'm just going to call him Bobby Strong. 
why don't I call him Bobby Strong? Well, right now it's 2013 and it's a brand new year. I plan to try as hard as I can to make Bobby Strong my boyfriend or at least go out on a date with me. Who am I kidding? I was too much of a wimp to like even talk to a guy, let alone go on a date with someone. So yeah, that's it for that video and I really hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure to give it a big fat thumbs up and subscribe down below if you haven't already. All it does is, you know, tells you when I have a new video up, so that could be helpful to you, I guess. Other than that, um, I'll see you guys next week with another video. Goodbye! Mwah.